Hey guys, how's it going? Welcome back and welcome to the final video in the series about the Lovejoy method and how it's going to help you paint your pet and get comfortable with the painting process in my upcoming Paint Your Pet course. Thanks so much for watching this video and all the other videos, but more importantly, thank you for your interest in learning how to paint. Um, your future self is already so grateful that you're taking these steps right now to get comfortable with the painting process. So good job. I've been receiving so many messages and excitement from so many pet lovers and beginner painters. I really can't believe it. The wait list has grown beyond the capacity of the class and I, I honestly can't believe how many people have, are, are waiting and signed up for this. So, wow. <laughs> I am super thrilled and excited to see um, how much you each are gonna grow with this course. I've been receiving a lot of similar questions and instead of replying to each of them one at a time, I'm going to answer all the top questions in this video. So if you sent me a message and I didn't reply, I do apologize. I'm doing my best to keep up with the inbox, um, but it is packed. It is crammed with emails for the Paint Your Pet course. So um, before we get to the Q&A, let me recap what we have learned um, throughout this video series. If you watch the prior videos, you will know that the Lovejoy method for painting is the most successful way to paint your pet and learn how to paint and create something made by you. That's the absolute best part. I also showed you that utilizing my method is easy and approachable and you will get great results on your first try. You are gonna impress yourself. I also showed you that by learning how to see the value scale in your pet's fur and creating soulful eyes Will make your painting pop. We also looked at many, many of my students' successes and their proud smiles and their fun pet portraits overflowing with personality. You also heard a few testimonials and the excitement from some of my students um, that just had so much fun painting their pet. Again, imagine the smile you're going to have on your face after you complete your painting. With my approachable method, you will impress yourself with unique portrait of your pet. So stop telling yourself you aren't creative or that you can't paint. Give yourself some credit. You are going to learn something new and you are more than capable of making this happen. You can learn anything with a simple and direct approach. With that being said, I am super excited to announce that registration for the Paint Your Pet course will be open in the next few days and I will be taking a small, limited group of students through the painting process. You will get a direct perspective from my point of view with tips and encouragement the whole time. This will be a direct approach to learning the foundational art skill that you can apply to future paintings. After you learn about the value scale, you will see the world from a new perspective. Painting your pet is going to help you find your joy in the process of painting. And that is the key to, being, uh, to finding some stress relief. So now let's jump into the Q&A. So we've got quite a few of them in here and I'm gonna address all the major questions. So first I hear a lot, I can't draw a stick figure, there's no way I'm gonna draw my pet. So my answer to that is don't worry, you don't have to draw a stick figure. You are gonna be printing your pet photo and you're gonna be tracing and transferring the outline onto the canvas utilizing carbon paper or a graphite transfer. You will have options for both. For your painting, you're going to be making dot and dash marks for the fur and just overlapping those dot and dash marks. I'm going to encourage you to embrace your inner five-year-old and just have fun. You will be proud of yourself for getting creative and stepping out of your comfort zone and completing a painting. So another question I get is, I've never painted before. Is this course for me? And to that I say, yes, this course is definitely for you of any age. I have specialized in painting first time and beginner painters for a really long time. So I've broken down the steps and will guide you through the process of your painting your pet. You're gonna learn how to see in a new perspective and you're gonna learn how to paint the value scale of your pet's fur. 
this basic art concept that you are going to learn, you will be taking it into all of your future creative projects. So many people ask, can I paint more than one pet? And yes, you will have full access to the course for, uh, um, you'll have full access for a year and you could paint as many pets as you want during that time frame. Another question I get quite a bit is, can I do this with my kids? And yes, I highly, highly encourage that you paint together with your kids, paint together with your friends and family. Um, these make wonderful memories and wonderful souvenirs, especially when you're painting with your kids for them to look back and remember the time that they painted with their parents. Um, <clears throat> I do recommend for ages eight to 13 that definitely paint with an adult. So that way some concepts can be talked about and explained together for ages 14 and older. This is a great art education tool and can be added as a foundational art skill, um, to their studies or for their schooling or just for fun. But I still recommend that no matter what the age is, please paint together because it's just great memories and you have even more fun doing it together. Another common question is, I'm concerned about getting the right supplies. Are they expensive? In the Paint Your Pet course, you will learn more about the supplies and what to look for. The more you paint, the more you're gonna find what you like working with. So I do recommend trying different supplies as you get more into it. But please remember the supplies do not make the painting. It's the hand that is holding the supplies that creates the painting. So acquire supplies that fit within your budget Expensive supplies do not guarantee a perfect or an amazing painting. All right, so another question is, when does the course start? You will have access to the course as soon as you sign up and you'll be able to work at your own pace while having um, access to weekly uh, live Q&A um, questions with me. And you're also gonna have access to all the Paint Your Pet courses so you can paint as many pets as you like you're also going to be included in a private paint your pet group that I'll be answering questions as well as you can ask other students um, some of their feedback and you can share your artwork there. So no matter what, um, hopefully I've got you covered and I'm going to be a uh, good support for you as you go through this process. Another question, how much time will this take? And you will be able to work at your own pace. Some of my prior students have been able to finish this in three days, within a week, and then they paint another portrait. Some students take 30 days. Some students have, take, uh, have taken uh, two or three months. I actually don't recommend taking longer than 30 days, but I do want you to go um, at your own pace. You will have access to the full course for one year, 365 days. And again, you can paint as many pets as you like in that time frame. These make fabulous and unique gifts for your friends and family. So I do recommend utilizing it and painting as many pets as you can in that time frame. Another question is what do I need to access the course? To access the course, you need a desire to paint your pet and a desire to learn a new skill. You could purchase your supplies beforehand or after signing up detailed, information is on the landing page as well as within the course. You're also going to need um, internet access and access to a laptop or a tablet. I also recommend keeping your cell phone close by so that way you can take progress pictures at each step along the way. Is this class beginner friendly? Most definitely. I have spent many, many, many years teaching first time and beginner painters exclusively of all ages. And so many thousands of my students have discovered their create creative talents and the stress relieving benefits of painting. So even if you have never, ever picked up a paintbrush, you will learn something from this course and it is approachable and you will have a, um, a nice finished painting at the end of the process. All right, so is it okay if I'm from overseas? Yes, this is actually one of the biggest reasons why I created this as an online course. I wanted to give access to everybody all around the globe, um, the simple and direct process of painting your pet. Um, after you sign up, you have 24 hour access to the course, 365 days for one full year. So work at your own pace, enjoy, join the groups, 
and um, ask questions as needed. All right, so what if I can't make it to the weekly calls? That is okay. The weekly calls are not required. Um, they're an extra addition just for if you have questions. So if you don't have any questions, you don't have to jump on. If you do have a question, jump on when you need to. So another question about the weekly calls. Um, I'm a shy person. Do I have to have my camera on and give my identity? No, you do not. So do not stress about that at all. Uh, you don't even have to have your camera or your mic on. You can type in your questions in the chat or you can send them prior to um, the call and I'll make sure that I address them. All right. Uh, next question. Do you guarantee I will see results? Yes, I actually guarantee that you will transform a blank surface into something painted by you. If you follow the Lovejoy method, you will end up with a fun portrait of your pet. But most importantly, you're going to realize that you can learn a new skill with a simple, approachable step-by-step -step method. All right, so hopefully I answered all your questions and calmed some anxiety about learning a new skill. You really are capable of doing this. I have put together a video and page with the course outline and the course will go live in a couple of days. Since I'm taking a limited number of students and providing personal support, here's what you need to do once you receive the registration email to ensure that you get a spot in the course. It is first come, first serve. If you signed up for the early bird waiting list, you're lucky because you will get access to the registration one day prior to the public. So set an alarm on your phone or on your calendar for July 18th. And when you receive the email announcement, sign up immediately to secure your spot. And if you still need to sign up for the early bird wait list, go ahead and click here and we will get you on the list. I really can't explain how excited I am to bring this to you guys and launch the course. It literally is a dream come true, having the ability to help people around the world learn how to paint in the comfort of their home and impress themselves in the process. I am so looking forward to watching your skills grow. So thank you so much for checking out all the videos in this series and getting and willing to push your comfort zone and learn something new. I'm really excited to see what you're capable of. So I will see you guys in class. Cheers.